Meanwhile, the Economic and Financial Crimes Commission, EFCC, has closed its case against a former governor of Plateau State, Jonah David Jiang, and a former cashier in the office of the Secretary to the State Government, Yusuf Pam. The case, which is before Justice C.L. Dabup of the Plateau State High Court, sitting in Jaws, was closed after the commission presented 14 witnesses and tendered several exhibits. Jiang and Pam are facing trial over alleged criminal breach of trust and misappropriation of Plateau State funds to the tune of 6.3 billion naira. After the prosecution closed the case, the defendants were expected to open their defense on Wednesday. However, their legal team, led by Mike Ezekhome, has informed the court of their decision not to do so. Rather, Ezekhome is a specifically within the Gulf of Guinea. President Buhari noted that the development required collaborative efforts among stakeholders to tackle. The president, who spoke at the International Maritime Conference in One River State, as part of the 66th anniversary of the Nigerian Navy. The report. Reduction in sea piracy and the listing of Nigeria from the International Maritime Bureau of Piracy List since March 2022. President Buhari said the conference will fashion out ways for collaboration among security agencies and curbing maritime crime in the collective waterways. We agree that these threats have become a transnational and have evolved beyond the scope and capability of one nation to deal with. The situation therefore calls for greater international collaboration. And this conference therefore symbolizes strategic collaborative initiative between the Nigerian Navy and other international maritime stakeholders. Earlier in his remarks, the Chief of Naval Staff, Vice Admiral Awal Gambo, noted that this year's International Maritime Conference, with the theme Optimizing Collaboration for Maritime Security and Socioeconomic Development in Africa, is apt and timely. Admiral Gambo noted the rising need for effective collaboration in maritime policing, stressing that the current security threat in the Gulf of Guinea is of serious concern to Africa and the global community. This conference will provide a veritable platform to collectively profit well forward in addressing the myriad of challenges in the maritime environment. It is therefore hoped that this forum will facilitate the most needed distance towards identifying viable concepts and constructive collaborative action plans that will support this strategic level initiative. Hence, it is against this backdrop that the team optimizing collaboration for maritime security and social economic development in Africa was conceptualized. Admiral Gambo said the Nigerian Navy has grown from an offshoot of the Nigerian Marines to a formidable component of the country's security architecture and a major player in the Gulf of Guinea security.